before you start your pepper too, you need to sonicate the water. Right, I've already sonicated it, so we need to put it here then uh, start sonication. And after sonication, around 30 minutes, you can start firstly the Persian. Well, for the Persian, you need to go here, in the top. Then you, change, you select solvent A, 100%, because I'll show you. Then you need to open the valve. Okay. And once you open the valve, you press... Okay. Now it is... Uh, Persian around uh, five minutes. So concerning the solvent A and B, so this is the solvent A. So this this one is going to the water here. So the water is the more polar solvent. Then we have the solvent B is the methanol, right? So we're gonna wait five minutes. And, uh, during the purging, you can check also the, the the tube here or the low if there are some bubbles inside it. In fact, there is no bubble here. If there is any bubble, it will be removed because if you get a bubble, it might change the the retention time of your. Um, if, uh, if your compound, for example, instead of be around uh, 15 minutes, it can be more or it can be before, or even it can be overlapped with another peak. So you need to uh, make the version, as you can see here. Look, so the tube is uh, vibrating. Yes, it's vibrate. Usually, what we do is. Uh, if you take a solvent from the storage, even if it is an organic solvent, for example, the methanol, you need to sanitate it. But sometimes uh, it's not so compulsory for the organic solvent, but for the water, it's it's obligatory. So you can't run your uh, experiment without sanitating the the water. But for the for the organic solvent, it's better to sonicate it also, but if not, uh, it might not be necessary. Oh, three minutes, we still have... Uh, right, so it is five minutes, it's already done, we're gonna click on the red square, then we need to, like, we have to close the purge valve then we click upon ok then we're gonna go to 100 percent B and we're gonna reopen it and then yes and the time let's start now right. now we're gonna wait five minutes of purging with the uh, methanol right this is it after we can stop and uh, start uh, the method that we want so meanwhile I'll try to for uh, when you would like to collect you can use some early Myers for example like that yes and also you can use that uh, too so you have the possibility to use a rack tube or to use an earlier it depends on uh, the mixture of your compound but usually the most recommended is some early layers and you need just to label them one two three four five and as well as the retention time of every compound in order to be sure um, once your compound is coming up. Uh, another point that I forgot to say, uh, here we, 
we have both of the bottles are filled. Once you fill a bottle, you need to go here because this is solvent A, solvent B. You have you filled bottle A? Yes. And it goes to 2500. Have you the volume? Yes. If, for example, you have only two, you can change it, for example, like two liter. So I've already filled both of them. So they are filled. Because uh, if you forgot, uh, during your running process, it will uh, uh, it will display a message here that you need to uh, fill the solvent. You need more solvent in order to be aware, just to stay. Uh, now it is uh, already five minutes. Now we're gonna stop it. the purge valve okay right until this point the purging is finished now we can start the method that we want you go to setup then you can uh, right you can edit some numbered method for example I select 26 okay and after here I need to write the name okay because I've already had this method this is the name this is the solvent system, illusion, detection and everything. But for the illusion, usually we wash with 100 methanol for uh, 30 minutes, right? And after 30 minutes, you change to your illusion system. I'm going to use 35 water and 65. So this is the detection wavelength. I have a maximum observance and the wavelength of 210 nanometer and 256. So I have the wavelength 1 and 2, this is collection, here I'm working with the AAC mode, and, uh, this is the equilibration that you can see here, sitting, uh, you don't have to, 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 don't have to uh, change anything here, the maximum pressure here is 250 bar, sometimes if you have a problem about uh, the, um, if you are using a more viscous uh, uh, sample, if it is not diluted, it can uh, uh, exceed 250 bar, then everything will be stopped. So be aware. Here we go. Now I'll, because I am, um, I think that that's all. Okay, here we go. This is the column, Kinetics 5M. CIT. This is the kind of uh, compound that I'm separating, the polymethoxy plugins. Okay, I click here, run. Right. So, as you can see here, so 30 minutes, 100 methanol. Then after 30 minutes, this is my illusion system. As you can see here, so we go here. And so and, uh, we will have the, the wavelength. This is 255, and uh, this one is the 200. Um, 210 okay and this is the the blue line is the pressure because the pressure is around 120 we started from zero of pressure then from zero to 120 so this is why the curve it was increased from here until here you see but now it will still stable it will go a straight line to be a straight line here because we are using only the methanol. The methanol it doesn't need a lot of pressure, only 120 around this uh, range. But once you use the water, it will be around 189-200. Right, this is the flow rate. If you have a problem about 
the pressure if it gets increased um, right uh, surprisingly you cannot control it you can reduce the flow base in order to regulate the pressure because pressure is everything so as you can see here we are washing the, the column now and after we will 